Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy Crab Lord back again. Today we're going to be doing a nice little vocal pitch video. Fun ways to mix your vocals using different pitches, different tones. Also, I'm making this video right before I go to the beach, so possibly this might not be out on time, but if it is on time, that means I'm successful. And I'm still drinking from the same jug. Bacteria. So anyway, before we get in the video, make sure to subscribe and already subscribe the notification bell as well, so you never miss a video that I post. Also, drop a like on the video if you like dropping likes on videos. Also, make sure to check out my description down below. A lot of sweet things down there. Preset packs, all my equipment, all my music, all my social media. A support link for the preset packs and a distro kid link to put your music everywhere. Anyway, pitch vocals of uh, extravaganza. Let's get in the video. Just like my last video, I'm going to be using some uh, loop beats. So what I have here is a beat that I put together. I called it the Brooklyn beat because I used all Brooklyn night stuff. And a nice little hip hop fat frog beat. Pretty groovy. <laughs> What I'm gonna do is make up some lyrics and then edit them in the way that I want using different pitches and what you can do. So let's start. Oh, made a little logic loop. Put them from the sides and I put them in a group. Then I went aside and I cooked up some soup. Had some gumbo when I put it in my poop. Do you wanna know why I rap like this? Do you wanna know why I keep my piss in jars? In mason jars. Do you wanna go and drive some cars? Do you wanna go and drive some cars with me? Do you wanna go and sing with me? Because this video is all over the place and it might get lost in translation, let me show you exactly what I'm talking about with the pitch shifter. That's what we're going to be using today. This is the preface part of the video, which you don't have to watch it if you don't, but this is how we're going to set up our track. You don't have to do it like this, but I'm going to do it quickly. We're doing an EQ first. Very simple. Just drop around 100, drop around here, and I usually do a raise like here. It's just simple like that. And then we're going to throw a compressor, a Namix compressor mono. And also to make this easy as well, we're going to be using the voice studio vocal okay and we're gonna turn down this a little bit and then turn this up okay and then we're gonna throw on the pitch shifter which we're using which is pitch pitch shifter mono yeah. save that for later we're gonna be using it and then finally a very simple reverb which is reverb silver verb mono stereo we're gonna make the dry 100 we're gonna make the weight 15 let's even make the size like 125 and make it like 10 percent wet and now back to the pitch shifter it's the most important part in a pitch shifter i don't know what sense means but i do know what semitones and mix is delay is how much, much you want to delay, delay on your, your voice. voice so if, if you, you do, do manual, manual you can do this and have it not, not delayed. delayed so look you turn it the manual timing make the delay to crossfade i don't exactly know what it does semi does is how high or low you want your voice to be it basically just bumps you up a note so you need to go plus 12 or negative 12 because that's how many notes are on an octave and that'll make you sound squeakier if you put it on six it'll be on the wrong key unless you do some sorcery and you can match the key with a six or lower which is possible but it's hard uh, mix is how much you want in your vocal so for example this is 12 25 percent mix it's on zero you can't hear me you can fully hear me. or it can be very deep if it's deep like that it's really sad the delay also makes it sound cleaner what you notice too is if you make the delay long it makes it sound cleaner but it is delayed so remember that it sounds cleaner but it's not right here so as you go up, you can hear how oh, my voice is changing. This. Now that you know that, you can start to mess with it however you'd like. This is my Mortal Kombat impression. Round one. Fight. Finish him. Fatality. Finish him. Focus. <laughs> To implement this effect is what I'm going to do is I'm going to duplicate a track. I'm going to use this as the sample. So this backup track is going to have either a deep or a high. We'll do a high first. Pitch. Pitch shifter mono. We're going to make it 12 semitones. Now, turn the mix up. Okay. You hear how it's like very sharp? We're going to take the purple and cut it off so it's not as sharp. So it sounds like this now. You see what I'm saying? What's really important in this too is how you set up your silver verb. If you use the high vocal, the high pitch, you don't want the main squeaky voice to be overpowering. So what you do is you take the reverb we made and you bring the dry all the way down and you bring the wet up like this. So it's just like pieces of my voice you can hear. It sounds good with the plugins because the dry is not letting the voice overpower you. The wet is letting it spread around you by giving the remnants of the vocal. The size is also spreading it. And then as well as the EQ, it is removing the ear piercing shriek of the high vocal. You get a cool effect like this. Do you wanna know why I rap like this? Do you wanna know why I keep my piss in jars? In mason jars. Do you wanna go and drive some cars? 
Now quickly how you would do it with a deep vocal. The EQ looks like this. You want to raise like the mid tones and then maybe cut off the edge so you don't get too much of those rumble grumbles. We're going to be going minus 12 for this one. 100% mix. The delay isn't too important, but if you want your vocals to be exactly timed perfectly, you go into manual and you make it zero. But I'm going to keep it at 10. It doesn't sound too bad. Silver verb. Now for the deep voice, you want a little more of it and then wet a little less of it. Same size. This is what it sounds so like. Now that you know all the secrets, now I'm going to show you all of the examples and freestyles I did to lead up to this point. So hope you enjoyed. Here it goes. Uh, I was smoking crack in the back. I was riding back in the Maybach. Now we was going down to town. We was gonna go and go round and round, yeah. Hey baby girl, what your name is? I'm gonna tell you, baby, no, I'm not famous. So I can lie. I'm gonna do a voice that's really high and low, and then put the that's already. Give a dog a bone I got addicted to watching Home Alone Cause the way he set up the traps And got the bad guys Cause they was taking naps And they was like Why are you doing this to me, Pap? Cause you my Pap You no longer my son Cause then you came down From Monday and Tuesday And Wednesday and Thursday But I never had a girl's name and I had a girl's name once, it was Hillary And she kinda sound like celery She sound like celery, she never wanted to tell me She was calling the phone and she's calling all her enemies Enemy? I don't know what I'm saying Well that's about it for me, hope you guys enjoyed that video as well as learned something as well And if you didn't, then that's my fault Make sure to drop a like in the video, leave a comment down below Tell me what you think and what I should do next And like I said before, make sure you're already subscribed the Description's chock full of sweet things down below Anyway, this has been a crab on how to use the pitch shifter in Logic Pro Dex using, using only stock plugins And like always, I love you, we out